Good morning, it's Barbara. Thank you for joining me for coffee. <sighs> I didn't do my gizmo because I've been sitting out here. It is so beautiful. It's about 73 degrees. It's very dry. Can you hear the cicadas? And the hummingbird's been coming back and forth. Dennis refilled the hummingbird food yesterday. And so the hummingbird's been very busy. I think I need to look up and make sure that that honey hummingbird juice we make, which is, you know, four parts water, one part white sugar, is actually nutritious because our hummingbirds, I don't know that they eat anything else. Makes me a little nervous. Of course, this is their second year um, at our at our feeder, so we shall see. It is really, really nice outside. I spent quite a bit of time outside yesterday, as much as I could. Or I was out for a while, not as long as me. But, yeah, Dennis and I sat out and had our cocktails. And really enjoyed the beautiful day. Today, I think we will be doing laundry. It's a great day to have clothes out on the line, so I'm pretty sure Dennis is going to be bringing laundry down when he comes. Our refrigerator was delivered yesterday with zero drama. It does not have any dings and dents in it, and they took the old one away. I took a little video of, you know, out with the old in with the new from sitting on the deck, but since I do not intend to go inside and edit this, I won't show it to you. It wasn't very dramatic. It wasn't good content, let me tell you. Pearl just came out. She's sitting in the sun scratching. The dogs really like it when we have a nice day like this because they like to be outside, but they want to be with us. You know, they're pack animals, and when we're not outside, they're not outside. So they'll have a lot of time outside today. Yesterday was very exciting for them. As you know, if you watch yesterday's vlog, my brother-in-law Gary and his grandson came. So the dogs had... By the time Gary left and I made my vlog, I was already exhausted. So, so but they had their walk as as per usual. Um, we went a little early because of the timing of the window for the fridge was two to six. But they we we were very late on their list, and they didn't leave here till quarter after six, something like that. So I just checked my bougie ice is not made yet. So the bougie ice will come in round ices, really, you know, and there are two settings for the bougie ice. You can have a medium grate ice, get six ice cubes a day, or you can have hard, super hard, clear round balls of ice and get three a day. Isn't that crazy? Well, I, I think they don't, it doesn't even start doing its thing until the freezer gets up to temperature. So it has, a, I looked this morning, there were no ice balls. Let's hope that thing works. I don't know. I told Dennis to set it on the three. I want really hard ice, really clear ice. But then I changed my mind because if I'm only getting six ice cubes a day, I want to, or three, I want to build up a few ice cubes. Plus, I'm going to throw away the first six ice cubes at least because they're new going through a new machine, you know, to kind of clean it out. We had to run a bunch of water through our, you know, through the door um, water dispenser. And I imagine that the first six ice cubes will be thrown away just for the same reason. So I won't be drinking with my bougie ice for a while, but I'll show it to you when there is anything to show. <laughs> refrigerator actually has more room than our old refrigerator because our old refrigerator had quite a big ice making um, gizmo in the top right hand part of the refrigerator and that's what made the ice for the door where you can get ice in the door. This one has a thin-ish ice making thing in the actual door right, you know, beside the dispenser on the other side. Now, our old one, a lot of the door was taken up by the dispenser part, 
and then it had that big unit inside so whatever the size of that unit was we have that space in our fridge now that we didn't have before maybe I'll give you a tour of our fridge tomorrow um well, I could give you a tour of our fridge now. I mean, it doesn't look like our fridge because, number one, it's clean. And number two, it feels very empty. Now, we have, for the last month, <laughs> month, almost, because today's July 31st. Oh, happy birthday to my ex-husband. July 31st. And July 5th was when we were supposed to get our refrigerator delivered. So we have not been, you know, we've been trying to keep the stuff in the refrigerator down because, you know, we were getting a new refrigerator. And I guess we've managed to do that. We've been eating our leftovers regularly, not acquiring extra stuff. Anyway... Did I just say I was going to give you a tour of the fridge? I might as well. What the heck? <laughs> okay, so here is our new fridge. It's a French door, and it's got two freezer drawers. It's the weirdest thing. It's an LG. <clears throat> we like the French doors on top. So... You can see here, this is the ice maker back behind, but I can we can still put our salad dressing there. So I think we actually have as much room in the this door as we did in our last one. But our last one had a whole big thing here that made the ice. So here's our fridge. This is our drawer we put the dog food in. So we'll see how that one, that one broke on our last refrigerator. Now, this door is full of stuff and this is our only tall space. We can, of course, reconfigure this if we want to, but our only tall space. And it's completely full, but our door was completely full before too. So with condiments and things. So anyway, that's the, oops. And it tells you when your door's open too long. <laughs> so here's the, oops, here's the top drawer. The idea is, you know, we had a drawer inside our other freezer, but, and see my bougie ice, there's nothing in there. Um, but it was inside the big drawer, and that drawer got so heavy. And then here, is the bottom this is dog food in here now this has a this has a uh a light i just noticed that anyway oh and dennis says one downside to this refrigerator is the front is magnetic our old refrigerator the front was not magnetic we had to put all the things that were magnetized on the sides <laughs> we haven't put anything back yet but anyway here's our fridge I'm very excited. No bougie ice yet. We even already have a couple things on top. Dennis worked really hard. He cleaned the top of that old refrigerator off so that the guys wouldn't have to touch how grody it was. So, there you go. Uh, we have freezers in the basement, so that's why there's not too much in the freezer. We actually have a refrigerator. Little, tiny, like, office size refrigerator in the basement as well um but normally that's a lot junkier looking but of course it's brand new dennis and dennis loaded it you know he he dennis is in charge of like when the groceries come home and i can't put things where i know they belong or if i i i can only put things where i know they belong and then dennis is in charge of the tetris that goes on so that the rest of the stuff can get in and I hardly ever put away the frozen stuff because he has a method to his madness which freezer things go in and that kind of stuff. So anyway, so the saga of the refrigerator is over. <sighs> Assuming I get bougie eyes.
But don't get bougie ice. The saga is not over. The old refrigerator that we got rid of was supposed to have a separate ice maker in the ref in the freezer drawer. It didn't come with it. And like when we called, they said, oh, yeah, we'll send it. Never sent it. So we never had that extra ice maker. And what I did to get good ice, it wasn't pleasant. So it was no big deal. I had to keep doing, pla you know, plastic ice cube trays that had no place. I mean, it's, I don't mind doing ice cube trays if I could just slide it on the little shelf where where they went. That would be great. But when they don't have any place, I have dumped so much water in that old freezer. So I'm hoping this works out. But anyway, enough of the fridge. And we're very happy with it so far. You heard it dinging. It's still working on, you know, getting up to temperature, I'm sure. And I don't... Oh. And it has an app. So Dennis put his app, an app on his phone and was giving me the statistics about the refrigerator while I was sitting on the couch. So there you go. Speaking of apps, today is the first day of my new exercise program. I'm wearing my exercise clothes. I did get an email at the like 12.05 last night, this morning, from Raina telling me what my schedule was and I had found in my app that there are you know to get the videos figured out how to get the videos so I am going to be doing my program today I'm going to do it up in my craft room which because I cleared it off is going to be work out to be a, a very nice um space for me to do that Christy said that she did not she has yoga mats but she didn't use a yoga mat she used um Thawking mats just to go under her knees when she needed support for her knees. So I don't have a yoga mat um, So I'm good, but I have blocking mats So I'm gonna use my blocking mats too and see how that goes. I'm happy to buy a yoga mat if I need one um, And she had a yoga block which was just a block of styrofoam about this big and I'm not sure it wasn't clear to me exactly what she did with that. It was almost like if you can't touch the floor, but you can touch this kind of a thing. I'm not sure. I don't have one of them either. And I've got to go in the basement and find my weights because I'm sure my weights are in the basement. Um, you would have thought I would have done this before, but I was waiting for an onboarding email or something, but I didn't get that. And I haven't paid. I haven't finished paying. So... If I don't hear from her soon about how to pay, I'll have to contact her anyway. But I'm assuming, I'm expecting to have like a Zoom call with her one-on-one -on -one at some point early on in this. It's a six weeks program. So, but I have the videos that, you know, access to the videos that I need to know what all these things are. i am got my clothes on. And, uh, and I have my space. Wish me luck. I'll let you know what I think. There's quite a few, six or seven different things I'm supposed to be doing. My guess is it's going to take me at least an hour today because I have to watch the video so I know what the heck I'm doing. Um, you know, each, each thing has its own video explaining how do you, how you do each of these exercises. And, uh, yeah. So I'm starting today. I told Dennis, I got my leggings on. I got my, he says, oh, you're wearing your workout clothes. I said, yeah, I'm wearing my workout clothes. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. So I'm going to assume that I'm getting <laughs> encouraging thoughts. Yeah, and I'm feeling a little upbeat today. Uh, by the end of the day yesterday, I had such anxiety. And I, you know, I have anxi some anxiety lately. You know, there's a lot going on with my parents. And, you know, Aura's here. And we're selling our house on Thursday. And, you know, all kinds of stuff. And... Uh, you know, we're retired. We can't have company and deliveries in the same day without, you know, anxiety. <laughs> anyway, but I'm feeling much calmer today. I, I slept pretty well. 
and yeah and I'm looking forward to my exercising today which is not typical for me so we shall see meanwhile I think Kim's coming today to visit her mother and uh, I'll let you know how it goes meanwhile I promised to put a link to the Facebook page in yesterday's video when I when I was on the zoom call I promised that I would put the and I linked to the Facebook page and I didn't so I will do that this for today and I'll go retrospectively put it on yesterday's in case people are looking for it there it's the flame and fiber zoomies fiber is spelled f-i-b-r-e the um, non-american way because the um, person in charge of this group is Megan who lives in New Zealand so she will um, invite you in I will put the link but you you have to ask to be invited and she will invite you in but keeping in mind she is in New Zealand and so the time zone differences all over the world are can be great so don't panic if you don't get a response right away because she could be sleeping so I'll do that because I can do that from my chair here <laughs> but I'm going to continue drinking my coffee and upload this video and figure out what time of day is the best day for me to do my exercises so I will ponder that thought meanwhile please take good care of yourselves please 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 stay safe and stay sane